The group trying to recall New Orleans Mayor LaToya Cantrell says it's gathered enough signatures for their petition. They say more than 49,000 people have signed. They've also filed a lawsuit claiming the benchmark should be lower because they say there are still voters on the rolls in New Orleans who have moved away or even died. Now the registrar of voters has to validate the signatures and if there are enough of them, a recall election will be set. The signatures are due to the registrar's office this Wednesday, and the update comes as a video of the mayor is circulating, showing her apparently giving the middle finger to a crew of Tux Float. And Alyssa Curtis has more for us tonight on how the video uh, may affect the recall. The group behind the petition to recall Mayor Cantrell says they have enough signatures. Eileen Carter, vice chair of the group No Latoya Recall, told WWL-TV Monday they will be handing in at least 49,000 signatures Wednesday to the registrar's office. So it will be a day of cleansing for New Orleans. So, you know, it's a day of prayer. I ask everybody to pray over the city. This isn't something that we do, you know, joyously. It's something that we do um, um, with reverence to our city and um, what the people really deserve. Now they're continuing to gather signatures to prepare for those that may be deemed invalid. We're asking everybody to put their foot on the gas at this point. You know, we want a cushion. You know, we want to put an exclamation point on this. So everyone who's been riding the fence, now is your time. Sign the recall. The announcement comes as Mayor Cantrell is facing criticism for seemingly giving the middle finger towards a crew of Tux Float. In the statement, the mayor's office didn't directly address the bird flip, saying cryptically, Mardi Gras is a time for satire and jest, all in good fun. But WWL-TV political analyst Clancy DuBose says every New Orleans mayor has been poked fun of during Mardi Gras, but none have taken the bait. Unfortunately, what Mayor Cantrell did was sink to the level of the people who were baiting her. And that's not an appropriate response for any elected official, especially not a mayor, because everything she does reflects the city of New Orleans. And that's not a good reflection on our city. When asked if the gesture would encourage more people to sign the recall, Dubo says he's not sure, but adds it definitely won't help her moving forward. Alyssa Curtis, Eyewitness News. The mayor's office has not responded for a request for comment about the recall update, and no one we contacted with the city council had anything to say about that video.